Flare up the temperate melting howlhorn drip fall vent fatal melting. Eh, not bad. Might pick harvest here. Ah. <laughs> yeah, morally wrong for not going for the <laughs> just just morally wrong. Not going in. I, I'm actually very sad that we didn't get Harvest. I would have loved to play Harvest here. Alas. Imsicle plus Harvest seems very fun. Mark of Invasion is good, I just have to find uh, a good imp. Harvest better than Burnout? True. Just always give you all three champion options? I feel like my win rate would probably shoot up a bit if I always got all three. I'm not sure, but it feels like the game would feel easier. Hey, molting it. What the fuck is this? Who are you? Four thousand. I think 4,000 damage Siren is faster because she gains damage at a rate of 4 per round and Melting gains it at 3. I'm just gonna play Rector. No point in some paths if you were given all three. Yeah, but like then they should just balance around trying to make each of the paths feel viable, is what I would say. Huh. Balance is difficult? True. But like they can just look at i imagine they can just look at what's working and what isn't and decide what needs to be changed from there in my train steward to death and then yeah i uh i think that there's no way right i can't i can't quite get this fatal melting in there huh which is very strange, because it feels like I should definitely have had a line to get that one damage in. Brawler Path more base damage? I, Brawler Path is the one that, like, I think Brawler Path is really hard to balance, and I think that the Revenge Path is hard to balance, but I think that they don't need to be changed, because the idea is that you mix them in with the other paths. They're not their main uh, path, right? I think that the Brawler Path is fine, because it would still see some play if you gave me all of the choices, because there are still times where I would pick it, where I'd go, oh yeah, we do want the extra one multi-strike here. I'm gonna take the pyre damage. I think it's fine. I like the idea of each clan- I mean, the other way they can do it is just have two of the paths always feel viable and then one of the paths feel like something that you mix in, which is what I think they're trying to do right now. Elder Helper. Unfortunate. I think we keep this boy alive? I don't know. Game design's hard and I... I will get, I will play the game as long as they keep making changes. Is it hot where I am? I don't know. I think so. I, I, all I really care about is that they keep trying to make things different. It daze you, it's fine. Our mini alpha thing? Oh, that'd be kind of cool. Get more get base damage getting Brawler as a sub path doesn't give you any more base damage, it just gives you an extra multi strike. Make Brawler 3 viable, and giving the Brawler path more base damage. Yeah, they could do that. It's up to them, right? Like, I, I really. I, I'm open to whatever changes they want to make, and I just hope they make changes that feel healthy for the game. I think there's a lot of ways they can go, and I'm basically down with whatever they do. Hey, remember that Transcendent I talked shit about earlier? Look at that guy. Because you got to keep in mind they don't have to like they they don't have to just think about rank twenty five Covenant, right? We also have to think about people who are playing on the lower Covenants trying to have a good time. I'll pick the perspective vote very here.
Lots of imps, huh? I feel like with Impsicle, I don't necessarily want to pick any of these. I guess I'll grab Welder Helper. He's fine. Yeah, seven damage, not too bad. Don't take anything with Harvest on this path. Harvest plus Imps is good. Large plus 25 and plus 10. What do you got? Yeah. Oh, wait, I picked Lady of the Reform. Yeah, 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 we just play Lady of the Reform. Who am I thinking? That's way better. Play Imps, idiot. I don't want to. <laughs> I don't want to. You can't threaten me. Inu, is it hot where you are? Is that why you're asking me this question? Because hmm. I'm going to make an imp floor. Feels like it. Unlucky. What are you going to do? Have you considered telling the heat to cool it? Chomper lame. This is not playing an infinite. I did pick up the Votaberry. Your personal fan is your lover. Inu? Everything okay over there? Quarantine's hitting you pretty hard, huh? I guess it's hitting everyone pretty hard, I suppose, but still. You don't just hold your fan. No. I, I do not. You're correct, I don't. Yes. Alright. This is fine. Slow dance with the fan. No. I don't feel like I need any of this stuff. Like, you can pick up the draft, but... Why? That's the question I wish to pose. What's the draft for? Used to clean up after Rector, I suppose. Alright, Draft. You've convinced me. Just arrived. Is this another imp run? Yeah. <laughs> oh, I play our infinites and imps anymore. I should pick one of these to play with the... I, like, I should probably pick Alpha Fiend or Branded Warrior. Which one's better? I think Alpha Fe eh. <laughs> You say Imp on them. True. I think I should play Branded on the top floor. Brawler 3 starts with 30 damage, gain 12 rage to break even to Slay 2 Brawler 1 in damage. And every round, assuming Slay 2 Brawler 1 gets 80 damage for any at least 14 rage generation to get on par. That's a lot of rage. That is a lot of rage. I agree. What if I get the double summon artifact? Am I really looking for the right path? Something for Brandon. There's a lot of unit upgrades I can find. I should do the responsible thing and go to the steel shop. Yeah. We can't high roll. Which fell is it? Oh shoot. Good. That is quick. That's not Rage 7. Alright. I guess we're trying quick on Branded Warrior now. Whoops. That's the wrong button. I guess he's gonna just keep it quick. Don't want any 
of these. None of those say imp. Skip. Purge a unit and upgraded version later. Convince yourself with math that Brawler Path sucks balls. Oh yeah, Brawler 3 is awful. God awful. It's just throwing. It, the idea is that you have to give it some sort of rage generation, but you like as you did the math, right? You need a lot of rage generation to have it even come close. And the thing is, you should also compare it to uh, compare it to also putting 14 rage on the other guy, because the other guy would still be able to take that rage because you're not you're not doing any upkeep on that one, right? Slay Prince doesn't need any upkeep, whereas the Brawler one does. Math is with that comparison. Ah, there you go. What am I giving you? Fatal melting? Sure. I think I will roll this shot. Yeah, cool. Quick multi-strike branded warrior. I think that each of the each of the champions has a bad path. Or like a path that you're supposed to splash, it feels like, instead of go all in on. I think it's reform, architect, uh, conduit, revenge, and brawler, respectively. Double stack hold over ritual battle, you can just barely pass the DPS at the cost of three energy per round. That seems worth it to me. You ask me? Worth. I think it's worth to just put Brandon on this floor. Yeah, why not? Any Stygian chance to win. 100%. Oh, it's double barrel Daedalus. That's right. I almost forgot. Get the spreading spores, heaven's gift. I'm not even sure if that's good. Yeah, true. Hellhorned is fine against the bombs, right? Like, we're not too... I'm not too uh, upset because Hellhorned is doing well enough against the bombs. I'm a little worried that I'm gonna get burnt out. I need to ping this haste enemy. Alright, we're fine. I was a little concerned I was just gonna have these two goons burn out, but it should be okay. To the zero cost? Yeah, so does the gold one, as it turns out. Uh, I didn't know it, but the gold trial, or like the gold upgrade also puts it to zero cost. Which I was surprised to find out. Am I wearing a mask right now? No. Time for Sleep Town, Cranberry. Have a good sleep. Enjoy Sleep Town. You could get sick, that's true, Dagon. You should watch out. Take care of yourself. Brandon did kinda he did kinda clean up here. No transcend imp people leave. Do I want the spike? Nah. Nah. And spell shield thought we just take capacity on this run so I can play more imps. Will the imp run do well without transcend imp? No. Next question. You minus one the hidden passage and then just call it good. I'm gonna do this. We're gonna look for plus ten holdover on vent as well. Unless the other one comes back positive. I could 
mean, honestly, it's not impossible to see myself going into Harvest Rector here. However, it just takes too much to catch up. I don't think it can be. Run is imps impossible to win without transcending. True. I agree. Please give me Transcend Imp or else. Consumer of Crowns gets us there too? That's true. I'll just pick up a Consumer of Crowns at our next draft. No oh, way. I'm putting Brandon up here. This is acceptable. I think that these guys going middle floor is fine. I have no way to actually keep the lady alive in rounds that are harder, but hopefully that's okay. Bunny is waxer snuffer. That's true as well. We are open to a waxer snuffer pickup. Although it's kind of awkward because of the imps. We could still see it. Me. I'm saying Pyre Chomper. Fucking meep, my man. Yeah, I did get Votavarius, true. We would also need Intent on Death. I think it's worth it to take the pieces. In a meep emote? I wouldn't be opposed to a meep emote. Meep. I wonder if it's worth it to just drop Brandon. Probably not. A pivot emote? Yeah, there's a lot of emotes that would be fun. But then I have to do something. Okay, first of all, get out of here. Don't want to see that. The that in this case is you, clipped defender. Leave. Being required to perform actions. True. I don't really feel like changing my emotes around very much, so I probably won't. When we get more emote slots, we'll look into more emotes, though. But that's, uh... I wonder how far away that is. I haven't looked at my analytics in a while, to be fair. To be H with you. If I'm being to be H, anyway. I don't think I've played this draft a single time. Please do not tell my imps to come on. I do not like this. Thank you. Parish idiot. I mean, the quick Brandon warrior, he's actually doing really well as he's just sitting up there and killing enemies. Two of days prevented a unit from going up a level voluntarily. I think that would be very strong. You could, if days just was like, they miss a turn and it's rooted. I think that would be strong. Or sometimes it would be really difficult to play with as well, because you'd end up stacking up floors like crazy. I don't know. It would be a negative and a positive. Do I want engulfed in smoke? What would be the point of root? I'm going to offer a counter argument here. What's the point of root now? There's like only two ways in the entire game to apply it. Like this whole other mechanic that's in the game with only two options to apply it, and one of them is a relic. I kind of want to grab Engulfed and Smoke just for the brand, and it's a good little splash. None of these cards are good. They'll probably add more to it. I hope they do. Big reveal. Oh, it's awful. They have room to expand upon. Yeah, I imagine the idea is that they're gonna add more cards. 
I, I wonder if they're gonna add more cards to each clan or if they're gonna add new clans. Full plane of rage if you got enhancement damage. I feel like this is a different uh, line of reasoning. The left. Remove train stewards. Do I want to duplicate anything though? Not really. Hidden passage isn't bad. We can't do this. I, I can't. It doesn't work. Not on this run. Do Brandon? Oh, that's a good idea, actually. But then I don't have space for imps. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. What is happening on this run? I like it, but also maybe I don't like it? I don't know, I accidentally applied quick and it seems like it might actually be really good. Two train stewards and added one brand and negative two space used. Alright, I guess that's fair. <laughs> I suppose I can't argue with that math. Not a black screen, y'all. Cyberstem, what's going on? If I didn't say hello and also what's going on, hello everyone, what's going on? I hope you're all doing well today. Or at least not bad. I guess tonight. How's it going out there everybody? Thank you. You've been a great audience tonight. Don't forget to tip your waitress. Tip your waitress. It's not a joke, I'm just saying it a second time for emphasis. For emphasis. I want to split you so I get that free sleigh up there. Just drop Rector, drop it in. Draft, I guess. And a tip we talking? I... <laughs> uh, no further questions at this time, please. I'm gonna close the floor to questions if you don't mind. <laughs> We actually want enemies to go up so that the Brandons get to kill. And just play imps up here, I guess. I need to imp important work. The impsicle, I like to live dangerously. I think that impsicle is just a good pickup, usually. I need to pick up a card that lets. I, I need to pick up endless for the lady, and then I think this runs actually pretty over. As it is, it's like, probably over, but I'm not 100% certain. Staff member here at Twitch, you need me to answer the question. I'm not a staff member at Twitch, what are you talking about? I think it's fine for me to play this molting in. End turn. Or are you saying that you are a staff member at Twitch? Damn. As if you are. Wait a minute, Dagon owns Twitch. I almost forgot. We have the Twitch staff member here. How much damage is this? It's a lot. I don't know that I'm secretly Jeff Bezos. No, 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 it's him. He's secretly Jeff Bezos. Dagon, tell him. Dagon? Oh my god. I've been Jeff Bezos this whole time? And no one told me? <laughs> You're... Dusk, you were right, this floor does just go insane. Look at these guys. 
<laughs> They're massive. What a weird floor. I'm really, I'm shocked that the quick ended up being so solid here. Now, do they kill self-made harpy is going to be the question, because I can't reform. I guess I just put a drag down, drop a votivary as well. Fine. Look at them. I think they do just kill him, right? How much damage are they doing? How much damage are you guys doing up here? Ow. That's a lot. I can't bear to watch this imp die. Oh no. <laughs> My imp. And then we just tank with welder helpers, I guess. This is the plan we're playing now. Ah, oh, Wicked Blaze is really good. Imp in a box, I suppose, is not bad. And then we get this shit. Okay. Strange, my sausage smells lemony. Might be a different shampoo maybe that you're using? Or like a different soap? Oh, you mean the imported one. <laughs> uh, that joke wasn't- that was a little hanging fruit joke. I feel bad. I'm sorry. Maybe there's a lemon spice hidden within. Find Rage Relic, go crazy. Say Rage, win game. Oh, hanging, huh? Yeah, you know. The, uh, the, the usual question. Was it hanging? Lemony. No, that doesn't seem right. You still laughed? I appreciate that. Hold over minus one stealth was a GG. I think this is a GG, too. This is good. This is bad. I don't know how this is. It's nice because Brandon ends up at 8 HP. It's not so nice because it makes it so my torches don't kill my own imps. But I'm not really torching them anyway and it lets me remove the torches with uh, certainty. I'm gonna skip it, I think. I think being able to ping my imps away is powerful. Am I torturing my imps, you monster? Inu? Do we need to talk about your Frostpunk playthrough? Heard your name, but you were AFK? Ah, Dagon. I was just, uh, someone accused me of secretly being Jeff Bezos, and I was like, wait a minute. Put a plus 10 here, and then I want to purge two torches. I think I want to purge one more card. It might be the Fatal Melting, but I don't think it is. What other card do I purge here? I think we're into purge drag territory. First nephew was born today. Yo, congratulations. Hell yeah. What kind of crazy uncle antics should you do with him? Hmm. <laughs> yeah, introduce him to my stream. That's a good one, Inu. Buy him a subscription at the age of zero. Need to keep him away from Inu? Good idea. Yeah, Fatal Melting is at least Bone Dog. I don't know. I'm not very creative. I don't have any good crazy uncle ideas for you. I think Champ goes here. Champ can go here. Okay. Oh, what I should have done is I should have played the Branded Warrior here, or middle four, and then ascended him. 
one of those minor optimizations that I can be doing. Do some the Magic the Gathering. Ah, that's a good idea. What I said on stream about Inu. Inu, what did I say about you on stream? You don't know what did I say about you? No, you're supposed to know. It's the long con. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I like it. But if I if I secretly play along like this, then Inu might go dig through the uh, the vods trying to figure out what I said about him. Think about it. I'm gonna end up getting hit for six here, and I think that's fine. Watched the vods last night for singing. Ah, oh, did you find any? You didn't hear any singing. That's weird. I definitely sang last night. Right, everyone. Here, Inu, I will- I'll make it up to you by singing for you right now. Get ready. <gasps> you thought. Uh, you fucking thought. <laughs> I am a genius. Thank you for noticing. What am I doing here? I don't know. Uh -huh. Thank you, Bone Dog? Question mark. True. Was lower on the tier with celery or blue cheese? Blue cheese. For sure. I do not like blue cheese one bit. And I like celery at least slightly. Although I don't like it very much, it's like I would prefer it over blue cheese. Blue cheese is better? Blue cheese is awful. Hate blue cheese with a passion. All I'm saying is if my girl and blue cheese were both drowning, uh, I would be at no funerals because we wouldn't throw a funeral for a salad dressing and also I do not have a my girl for the purposes of this uh, hypothetical which with, with which we are discussing. Celery is tasteless solid water. It definitely has a taste, because if it didn't have a taste, then why would I not like it? I think is how I'm supposed to phrase that. That's a pretty good turn. What about a my guy? Uh... Ah fuck, the song is my girl. I was gonna... What would make me feel this way? Uh, my guy? Five guys. There you go, Inu. Does this satisfy your desire? All I am to you is a person who sings. <laughs> what would make me feel this way? Overpriced burgers. Uh, I, you know, they were very... Uh, they were very good for the price, though. They have good stats for the cost. Reform well, we're out for a good call. The simp is, uh, thick. Uh, and we also have this floor over here, I guess. Five Guys doesn't actually fast food. I mean, what do you qual- what, what qualifies something as fast food? Thick of the brary variety. I don't know if I was thinking it's brary thick, but it is thick. That's a thick ass strawberry. Hot damn. Thanks, Bone Dog. Is 
Isn't Chipotle wasn't fast food then you guys sick there like three times? Ah, yes. I think my one, my, definitely my favorite story to tell is my, yeah, that time that my coworker got sick from Chipotle story. I think that story is just a classic. I shouldn't have sent a foul. There is no reason to. We get one more imp if I don't. Five Guys is death in burger form? Really? You don't like Five Guys? I like Five Guys. I thought it was pretty good when I had it. Play Ascension 5, run on the silent. Take every card that says Shiv or zero cost attack on. That's a good idea, Dagon. Shiv it from the start. Unironically, reinforce. <laughs> Doubling armor on an imp probably wins us the game. What a horrible sentence. That guy's almost as overrated as Shake Shack. I've never had Shake Shack. I need to, uh, I need to stand up because my foot is sleeping. Third one pick. Blade Dance, Cloak and Dagger, Accuracy. Yo, you pick Accuracy, right? Easy shit it. I need to, uh, stand. Please rise for the national anthem. Oh, say. There's this cool streamer playing Monster and he loves Melting Stygian. Oh, is, dude, do you know someone else who loves Melting Stygian? I love Melting Stygian. Wait a minute. This link is my YouTube channel. You should go click on it and subscribe. Don't forget to ring the bell as well. I knew this proud of fresh cut fries should be a red flag. You've worked at enough stadiums and restaurants in your life and they just cook maggot ridden potatoes. And they're so fried you can't even tell. I mean, it's just extra flavor, right? So what pizza story from Spoonie is the best food story you've heard? Too bad his mental health died. I don't think I... Oh. I don't think I've heard the toilet pizza story. Also, I don't think I know who Spoonie is. Big Shack has horrible AP? Ability power? I don't think I want to take armor 20 here. There's a lot of variance on this run, I'm afraid. As far as you know of locally that still exist are these huge cut steak fries that are made out of the freshest potatoes and they are so good. There's a restaurant very close to me that used to have really good fries, but I think they had to like change their fry recipe because of the old Rona. Very unfortunate. Because they had some killer fries. I'd like to put branded here? I think? I think so. Thanks, Vent. Rona killer fries. Uh, come on. It's just, if you will allow me a little turn of phrase, perhaps. Maybe the reform is going to get ripped up here. Never mind. Who's there to save the day when the world looks grim? Who's our favorite superhero? Who's your favorite superhero? Superman? Batman? No. Molting Imp. You know a local mom and pop store that actually cares and will throw out bad potatoes then rock on? Five Guys is not that place. You've seen them cook potatoes. I've, I've done homemade french fries as well. They come out pretty well, I gotta say. Very strong choice. I should just, uh, I should put this guy in front so he dies. Yeah. And then we even get, we even get the collector. Thanks, Molting him. Very cool. What do I do with Votaveri here? I think I put her down and let her just take up Rage, right? And maybe I let her take up the, the armor mantle? I think so. Roast potatoes in variety of ways. Frying is too much work. Yeah, you know. I agree. Deep frying is overrated and way too much work for my small brain. Do not enjoy. Ping you. 
play another welder helper. Uh, bye bye, by the way. I love, you know, we talk about best death knells in the game. I think welder help, the imps when they go bye bye is extremely good. Big fan. Do I want to drip fall anything here? I think I want to drip fall this welder helper. 99% sure Votaberry is a dude? I'm actually not sure. They are, uh, I don't know. I have, honestly, we should just call them they, right? They may be unisex, that could be it as well. Oh, they're triggered twice? All of my summon abilities triggered twice. Smile. Big Votaberry. Made of wax? I don't know. I mean, I can't ask Votaberry, which is what I would usually do in this circumstance, so we're kinda on our own here. Guess we'll just double her up to 240. There's an artifact for that? There sure is. There sure is. These boys unfortunately have not gotten to rage too much, so we may find ourselves in a little bit of trouble. But then again, perhaps not. Get him out of there. I should hold this over because this boss does spawn with two shade wings. Should make sure I have that ready. Oh, she steals the kill. Oh no. Give me another rage in, please. Oh yeah. You just reform another Rage Imp. Oh no, I got him out of there, that's right. I can't reform another Rage Imp. Hmm. This is really odd. Like, just in general, I think this run is really weird. Will vote a very gender and no results. Inu, I'm gonna tell you, somehow that doesn't shock me. Bye bye. We can see the fall off of our branded warriors here because it's hard to get their rage going. However, we will we will hopefully remedy this by doing some better planning. Sacrifice imp cards aren't bad. Battering ram is kind of an interesting one here, right? We could theoretically win off this if I... Alright. I think it's worth a one card slot. What can you tell me that will shock me? Uh, you could tell me that you're about to uh, try out your new Tesla gun on me, which would, I imagine, shock me. We're going. Potatoes, but you don't really count them now. I mean, they are technically a vegetable, but if you count potatoes in the vegetable category, it's just going to be everyone's favorite. If anyone is not able to hear the stream right now, they need to uh, pause or like refresh. However, uh, they can't hear me right now, so they don't know that. Let's finish this run out. Where are we? Two Brandons, a Draft. Right, okay. We're going into the Seraph combat. It is Sap Seraph, which is tough, because Branded Warrior is probably going to struggle to scale unless we get some Rage Imps. But we'll just hope to get some Rage Imps. And I think we're going to go left path here. I don't have anything I really want to duplicate. Okay. Right. I think our win condition is battering ram. Come to think of it. Maybe I was supposed to go to the magic shop. 
probably was actually supposed to go to the magic shop. Hmm. That's too bad. I think we can still get there. What do you have for me? Endless plus 25. Over here, it's Pyrewall, Hellpact, and Consumed Crown. I think I want to grab Endless. Endless on this Welder Helper might just win us the game straight up. There's a bit of safety in Endless on Lady of the Reform, but I'm going to try this and we're going to see if it can work out. All right. We have arrived at our plan, which I guess is to kill Seraph by one-shotting him with a battering ram. That's a weird plan. I guess we can roll this. Should maybe give you plus 25, but I think... I guess I won't see Endless, so I should give her plus 25, and then we'll roll this. Nah. Well, probably actually better to do with this. Alright. Let's give it a shot, shall we? I think that this is a... Uh, this combat will probably win or lose based on... Not really sure. We'll see. We shall see. No Brandon is kind of interesting. It's also a shame that we lose our top floor here for space because I want to play Brandon, Brandon, Imp and then be able to drop them. However, I cannot. Just win. You know, you've been talking to that pickle too much, haven't you? But it's actually a good idea to leave these Shade Wings alive so that the Brandons can farm them. You can rage here and then just go up, I suppose. Didn't talk to him at all today. Oh wait, you did, but it was for like a minute. Did he kill? Did you team kill him in Halo again today, or did you decide to spare him? Seven win streak failed. Unfortunate. What killed you? You told him you were hungry. Huh. Bat mobs killed you on the Seraph fight. Ah, oh, the classic. I think it is fine to have you die here, because I haven't drawn Wicked Blaze yet. And I need to I need to make space, so I need to actually get you off of this floor. And then I need to be able to, I need to be ready to ping one of these welder helpers away. Okay. Never died to jaw one. <laughs> That's what Mega- you're- you're- you must be a plant from Mega Crick, because that's what they want me to think. They want me to think there's someone out there who hasn't faced down the tyranny of Jawworm. I know better, Mega Crit. He's a dookie mob, yeah, okay. You must be a plant. Okay, if I battering ram this front boy, this combat goes from kinda scary to really easy, I think. Yeah, this combat just gets out of control here. Although Rector's getting kinda smacked. I need to play Tangle Deep. I've been so I've been told. Perhaps one day. What do I want to do with you, Draft? I think I'm winning off of this floor, which means that I just want to have all my setup based around giving them as much rage as possible. Wow, we generated like 12 rage. Crazy. Make that one day sooner. I'll get around to it eventually. I'm sure. Tip the waitress, she said, wrong tip, bro. What to do? I'll be apologize. <laughs> I think that's what I would suggest here. You might just want to apologize to the waitress and just kind of try to sneak out. Okay, I... 
I think we want to start killing the shade wings off. I'm not sure. But I think we want to start doing this. I think I want to kill my Rector off. Uh, this is kind of awkward. However you slice it, this one looks a little awkward. No, doesn't it? I guess not. I guess these guys just wiped the floor. I think the Votaberry might take one here. 42 and then 3 times 42? What is that? 124? Yeah, okay, Votaberry takes one here. This is a really weird fight. I'm limited by the amount of imps I can play per turn and that's it. Wow, it was exact lethal. <laughs> that's crazy. That does it, but better. Oh yeah, that's right. First got reset. Guess... What was that? Guess who, where? I like it. Who, where? There we go. Updated. I think I keep playing Welder Helper, even though there's nothing I can really do off of Welder Helper. I still should keep playing him just because I... Eh, maybe not. Because I accidentally played out all my energy. Too bad. Thought she'd appreciate it, you know? I guess that's a pretty good tip to give a waitress. This is up to 800. Hmm. I think I want to have Lady of the Reform to die, but I think she's gonna die at the wrong timing here. Hmm. So it's 60, and then they kill this one, and then the 15 goes through. So it's two slays. Is there a world where I get three? There is not. So we accept our two slays and we move on. And I think that... I think that we just engulf and smoke here. Stream isn't over? Nah, I just had to restart it. And then it came back to me. Feeling this would happen where my everything's just kind of fucked. I don't know if this floor wins, but I think it does, right? Doesn't this look like a winning floor to you? Looks like a winning floor to me, anyway. 72, 72, 72, 72. Okay, so I can trip all you down. You won't die, but it's fine. I think I just hit this here. 400 armor is probably enough to win the game off of. Professional opinion, I think that's enough. Meanwhile, we got Lady of the Reformed, Rector, and the Imp Gang just chilling. Votaberry's up to 69 damage, holy moly. I think this is good enough. It's a weird one though, because this isn't one that answers all the questions in a way you would expect. I just win by stacking a million armor, and that's also fine. Stacking a million armor and then just having Branded Warrior go out of control. Nice. Unfortunately, no longer. 96, 96. You kill this one. 96. I think I just want to ascend this guy so that we get more rage. I'm not mistaken. And then I could also, uh, I could just stop this one. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. Even I won't save you now, says Raptor. So they're doing roughly 200, they're doing 400 damage per round up there with 400 armor as well. How are you feeling, Seraph? Good? No? Not good? Ah, that's weird. How does this 1600 damage make you feel, Seraph? Bad? Oh, that's weird. 
Three rounds, huh, buddy? I gotta tell you, that's rough. But I can't get the reinforce back just to really, really flex. Hmm. All right, Seraph. Good fight. <laughs> who would win? Who who would be better in a combat? Who do you think could win in, in Mortal Kombat? The leader of heaven or the literal smallest person in all of hell? That's the question. This is like Seraph dying to like a fucking rat. <laughs> Couldn't even punch through. You hate to see it, Seraph. Except I don't hate to see it. See you in heck, buddy.